Hi friends, welcome to Queer Kid Stuff. I'm Linz and I'm Teddy. <laughs> and this is my best stuff friend Teddy. And this is Teddy's Book Club, where we're reading LGBTQ plus picture books with you all every Saturday morning. This week, we are reading a book called What's an Abortion Anyway? Linz, what is an abortion anyway? Well, we're just gonna have to find out in the book, Teddy. This is What's an Abortion Anyway by Carly Maines and Emulsify. And I'm really excited to read this book because I don't think there are any other picture books that talk about what an abortion is. And it's really important idea to understand right now. Isn't it, Teddy? Yeah, that's right. All right, well, let's learn what an abortion is anyway. <laughs> you ready, Teddy? Ready. All right. Let's dive in. All right, my friends, this is What's an Abortion Anyway by Carly Maines and Emulsify. What's an abortion anyway? Let's find out, my friends. Oh, I love reading the dedication. This book is dedicated to anyone who has ever had or ever will have an abortion. How wonderful. All right, let's get into it. When a person gets pregnant, many different things can happen. Some people are pregnant for many months and have a baby. That's what happened to you. Hmm. Some people have a miscarriage. A miscarriage is when a pregnancy isn't healthy enough to keep growing. Hmm. Some people have an abortion. An abortion is when someone decides to stop growing their pregnancy. Hmm. Going to a health clinic over there. There are many different ways that people who are pregnant can have an abortion. Some people see a doctor who does a special procedure to remove the pregnancy from inside a person's body. Other people take medicine to stop the pregnancy from growing bigger. Medicines like misoprostol. Abortion is very safe and millions of people have abortions every year all around the world. No matter how someone has an abortion, everyone should be able to decide the way that is best for them. I think so too. People have abortions for different reasons. Some people have abortions because they like their family exactly as it is. Some people have abortions because they can't take care of a new baby right now. Some people have abortions because their doctors say pregnancy could make them sick. No matter the reason, everyone should be able to make this decision for themselves. That's the most important part. People have many different feelings before, during, and after their abortion. Some people want to talk about it and some people don't. And both of those are totally more than okay. Some people feel happy or calm. Some people feel sad or lonely. Many people feel all these things at the same time. That's a lot of feelings, isn't it? No matter how someone feels about their abortion, they deserve to be treated with love and respect. Exactly because we can never really know what it is like to be someone else. And that was What's an Abortion Anyway by Carly Maines and Emulsify. Oh my gosh, I just learned so much about what abortions are from What's an Abortion Anyway by Carly Maines and Emulsify. What did you learn, Teddy? That's right, Teddy. 
Thank you so much for joining us. And we're going to be back next week with another video reading another LGBTQ plus picture book. Make sure you grab your grown up and check out the bookshop.org link where we have links to all of the books that we read and hang out with us every first Saturday of the month for a live Teddy's book club reading on Zoom. We'll see you there. Bye everyone. Bye friends. <laughs>